because this one's not working, this one is 72 in this room, right? But it keeps running, running, running. You can see that 72, 72. This one, I bet you, is not cooling at all because a couple weeks ago we had to add some charge to it, and I'm going to add some charge to it tonight and put the sensor in just to get them going because the guy comes home for the weekend. Friday night, like five o'clock, something like that. It's 4, 429. I'm going to a house right now. There's a cop right here though, so hold on. I'm going to a house right now where the unit, the guy says the unit's frozen. So we're gonna check it out and see what's going on. He's got like 25 units at this place, so I'm pretty familiar with the house, but um, let's check it out and see what it is. I hope everyone has a nice weekend, too. Supposedly, this unit here, which says, let me see, it's not frozen. Back up all court. Maybe he turned it back on. Let me go check it out. I know what's happening, though. He's got a thermostat outside of the racquetball court. So the system never satisfies. Alright, so this system back here is what? So there's a racquetball right below us, racquetball court right below us. Let's see it froze. So there's a thermostat outside. The door to the back racquetball court which is a terrible design but i think they didn't want the ball to hit the thermostat but that's not gonna it's not it doesn't matter if, if the ball hits it it hits it it is what it is but i'm gonna throw in a wireless sensor because he's got a pro 8000 all right so this unit here it's maintaining now this one is it was off, okay. Which is this one right here. And it's got three other heads, some other cassettes. Let me go inside for a second. I want to see something. Yeah, it's freezing in here. Small return. Um, so, what I'm going to do right now, because he's got the Pro 8000, if he likes it or not, we're going to put a sensor here so that because it returns there. So, it's the best we could do. And he can put it up higher if he wants, but. That way you get the proper uh, cooling and it doesn't over run and run and run and run and run and run and run. Because that's what it's doing. It's not cooling also, he just told me. So the reason why it was never a problem with this, which it, it is a problem because this one was tricking this thermostat into thinking it was satisfying, right? But now that this isn't cooling, because I just talked to the property manager, that this isn't cooling, this is just running, 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 running. So it says 72, but it feels like an icebox in here. Let me get that. It says 72, right? Look how fast we're dropping. Like I'm, like I'm in a supply, it feels like. So you're already five degrees off. Um, yeah, six degrees off. So that's crazy. It's dropping, dropping, dropping. So this just runs and runs and runs and runs and it freezes. But I'm going to put the sensor in right now. We'll take care of that. I just got it up. I just asked the property manager. He said just to do it. 
But I don't know if the racquetball hits the wall. I mean, it does what it does. You know, hopefully they're better players and they just don't let it hit the back wall. This is like reading your supply temp, like when you throw it in the in the supply. All right, so you have uh, obviously thermostat's not going to work outside. That's nuts. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Because this one's not working. This one is 72 in this room, right? But it keeps running, running, running. You can see that 72, 72. And this one, I bet you, is not cooling at all. Because a couple weeks ago, we had to add some charge to it. And I'm going to add some charge to it tonight and put the sensor in just to get them going because the guy comes home for the weekend. With the Pro 8000 um, racquetball court issue. So I think I showed it 58 degrees it came down to in that room. Just running, 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 running. So I went out to my truck and didn't have a sensor. I had a wired sensor, not the wireless. So we're going to return on Monday with the wireless one. But um, he's got a major leak in that Fujitsu. So we are going to do a leak search Monday as well when we return. Who's the boss? All right, let's see. 